What is up my friends? So tonight I'm actually going to be seeing Zombieland 2. I will have a video for you up then and Zombieland 2 is pretty much going to kick off the Halloween videos that are going to be coming out daily. So 13 nights of Halloween um, we're going to be doing that. So uh, different movies, uh, Train to Busan, um, Little Monsters which I just checked out and a couple of others that we'll be getting. And he explains reviews all of that so if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. But let's talk about another killer Halloween show not really but it does involve killers and it's pretty much turning into that and that is insatiable insatiable season one was something that had a lot of controversy surrounding it and then i feel insatiable season two was pretty quiet in its release because it took me uh seeing people commenting on my insatiable season one video that hey insatiable season two is out go watch it and i did that my friends so pretty much we are here at insatiable season two with Patty now being fully deranged. So at the end of the season, we finally find out who is the pageant killer, and it's not Bob who is actually framed for it. So we come to find out that Regina is the pageant killer, and then most of the episode we see Patty trying to get rid of Stella Rose's body, as she is carrying her around in a suitcase, trying to find the right moment, right place to dispose of her body. And this is pretty much a cherry on top for Regina, who has already been playing planting keepsakes of all of the victims in Bob's apartment so that he will get framed for it and the discovery of Stella Rose's body will be an added bonus on her mission to get Bob framed. The episode concludes with Patty visiting Bob still wearing the Miss American pageant crown and then he realizes a strong discovery that maybe it wasn't all his fault Patty is doing all of this because of her bad influence it's actually because she is liking the killings and now Bob has to figure out a way to get his name cleared and bring Patty to justice. So yeah, pretty much that's how the show is ending. We see um, Patty on this sort of frenzy now and I believe season 3 will just continue this on and I believe the show will get renewed for season 3 and I think that they are going to get more into that different um, wackiness that the show has especially when it comes to the third season and especially Bob trying to get his name cleared so there's many people that could actually bring Patty down one of them being Magnolia Bernard she just got her memory back and now uh, remembers Patty killing Christian while she was in the uh, car. I could actually uh, bring her down is her her best friend Nani which would be a pretty big upset because she has confronted Patty already and Patty reveals that she has not just only killed Christian but five other people as well. And then there is also Patty's mother who could actually try to help uh, Bob and actually stop her Patty from killing again as she is now his new girlfriend so there's a lot that can be unraveling in season three season two pretty much set us up on this uh, new Patty who is on the hunt to kill and with all of these people set up to potentially stop her and try to help Bob get his name cleared yeah, in the end, Regina is the pageant killer. She is the one who killed Roxy. She has framed Bob for this as well as everything else. And now Patty has admitted to killing Stella Rose, drug dealers, Gordy, and even Christian. And Patty pretty much just laid it out that nothing tastes as good as killing feels. So, it seems like season 3 is going to be one heck of a ride. I have concluded we have a pretty awesome season 3 lined up where we have Patty trying to get Regina and make her confess to the crimes that way Bob can be let free and Patty says that she is going to be taking her out and now we have Bob knowing what he has helped to create with Patty and trying to pretty much help her at the same time also get Regina and it's just it's just a convoluted beautiful mess and I'm excited for that will Bob clear his name what will happen with Patty it's all gonna be season 3 and I'll make a video where I talk about a theory I think might uh, wrap this show up for season 3 and if you want that video let me know like this video comment share all that good stuff but what was your favorite moment in the show are you excited for season 3 and what do you think about this whole thing? Do you think Bob is going to clear his name or what do you think is going to happen? Comment your theories below. But anyways, as I said in the beginning of the video, I will be making a Zombieland uh, video tomorrow as well as some more uh, zombie movies and other horror movies as well for the countdown to Halloween. And I'll also be doing a special video where I will be making my Halloween costume in a video. So get that 
pretty soon pretty pretty soon so yeah anyways as always 10,000 subscribers let's get to it like comment share all that good stuff i'll see you next time stay positive